I do uh, often think about just, you know, sit down and think through the piece and imagine playing it and being in that state where the the physical technical aspect isn't a challenge. It's not getting in the way where you're just in your mind. You know, you can, everything can go well. Um, you have much less difficulty in, in playing everything exactly how you want it to be played in your head. So going through that and then realizing how that how that feels when you're doing that mm -hmm. means you can then take that forward and, and translate it to actually doing it physically so you know how it feels mentally just then actually do it mm. <laughs> and it, it makes things so much easier even if you've got a, a slight technical challenge that was one of the biggest lessons i was taught actually by a teacher uh, who's in finland now kevil shah um, a great pianist amazing teacher and he taught me when you have a technical issue instead of you know instantly going oh i must fix this and just playing and playing over and over again actually stop playing and take a step back stand up walk away from the piano and think about what you're doing and actually a lot of the time you'll think you know you'll do a body scan and you'll think oh something's not right in my shoulder there or you know i'm not quite using the right arm movement at that place and actually just thinking through and then imagining how it will feel when you can do it and what what you need to do to make that happen actually is much more valuable than just banging and banging over and over again at the keyboard trying to trying to find it mm. so